Hey yo, what's going on Sammy Nation? It's Sammy here and welcome back to a brand new video where today guys I'm going to be playing some more Retail Tycoon 2 since they have released a brand new update which is the ice cream update and of course that means we can finally have ice cream in our stores which I haven't actually been able to do. I'm surprised they didn't actually add this earlier but um, yeah hopefully it is really nice. Here is my store which I didn't actually make in the last video. I made a few little tweaks to it here and there. You know, changed the cash register location, got to this new area here um i got the finance rep over here now and i did a self checkout because my checkouts are getting full up earlier and obviously the new posters and stuff which are actually really cool uh they actually won a like they won like a competition on discord and um they actually got implemented into the game now i'm sorry if my voice seems a little bit off i do have a cold right now i'm so sorry about that but yeah, I think we should just get straight into the video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. That would be great. Every like is one tub of ice cream for you guys. So I think you guys should do that. And I'll give it to you for free. Uh, it will be shipped in three to five business days. But yeah, let's just get straight into it. So you guys know the drill already with these videos. We have to delete everything in my store. And I'm actually going to keep this store because I do love this layout a lot. And I do want to keep it. So um, let me just delete all of this stuff, you know. You know how it is, guys. And I will need to place down some more things. Ugh. And by things, I mean, like, these cabinets at the top. Because look how much space I have. I have no space. Exactly. So, real quick, I'm just going to close up shop. And something I like when you close the shop is that people will just start checking out instantly rather than looking around to buy stuff. So, um, yeah, it's really helpful. And my guards are on the way. You're under arrest. Okay, right, look, he's not going to be bad. Yeah, we're making quite a lot of money. Also, you guys have probably seen my brand new GFX. Made that myself. Very proud of it. Here it is on screen right now. It looks amazing. Love it. I spent like an hour on it, yet. not an hour, like three hours on it yesterday, that's amazing. Yeah, that is everyone out of the shop. Do you see how quick that was, guys? But um, yeah, here's like the bare bones of the shop, I guess. So I'm going to quickly uh, go downstairs and just delete all of this wooden flooring because, you know, I can't have wooden flooring in an ice cream store, you know what I mean? That's nice. We're going to have to do something more like tiley and I might remove these like basket hanging tree things. I hate them. I don't hate them. They're really good, but like they don't fit in, you know? Oh, there is a new marble here. Wait, I just want to look at that. Oh, wow, that looks nice. But we're not going to do that. We're just going to have that, like, checkerboard floor. I think we should do that for the rest of the store, actually. That is a really nice pattern. I do like that. And it's only $80, so that is good. We've got some new things going on over here. Now, obviously, we're not going to have just ice cream. That is kind of boring. Can't just have a shop full of ice cream. So we're going to have to implement some other stuff in it as well. So this is a cabinet. That is not what I want. I want a freezer here. So if we, in the middle, have this freezer section, that is really nice. Three freezers right there. And then at these sides here, maybe I can have a freezer bin. Two of them, either side. Just like that. It is already actually looking really nice. Now, I do kind of want to change up the outside a little bit. I want to make it look like uh, more ice creamy, you know? That doesn't make any sense. And you know what's kind of an issue? This might lead to a lot of crampness. So I might have to leave these two on the side here. And I could put... um a different like decoration there let's put these walls in as decoration now there isn't going to be anything on them it's just going to be empty i think that actually looks really nice it's like wooden i like that i like that but there is a slight issue i can't place it in front of these freezers okay i think we should just have regular walls on it maybe does that look better no that doesn't look better okay we're gonna leave this back wall back wall will stay how it is okay let's get rid of these uh hanging potted plant things and see what other decoration we can add in. So, first off, let me change these up front. Okay, let me delete them. There you go, that's a bit more ice creamy, right? Let's delete this poster. We'll go, like, more purpley and stuff inside here. Let's get another one of these posters. Boom. Okay, what can I have in the middle here? Let's look at the decorations. I mean, there's not really much I can put there. But I do kind of want something there. Maybe if I get some pillars in there, just like that. That was pretty nice, I guess. And uh, let's quickly go to stock shelves. Okay. So here's the cold food. Okay, so I'm filling all of my shelves up here with ice cream. And real quick, I've got to delete all of this stuff in my inventory. I have 1,000 candy. Are you serious? Okay, let me just recycle all this and I'll get some money instead. Okay, guys, so I've got a bunch of ice cream in my stuff now. And all of it is filled. But I'm still not ready to open up shop because I want to do some more decoration. Can't just leave it like this, guys. Alright, guys, so what I've done right now is I've actually removed these pillars and placed some stairs here instead. So we can go upstairs because I don't want it to be a one-floor store. So I am actually making it second floor. That way, I have uh, space for more customers and it will just look better from outside. And I've obviously got to move this fat sign here. So where should we put this? I'll put this on the third floor. But we'll leave it here for now. Now we do need a room for our manager because our manager's just chilling on the floor so you do have to kind of make that otherwise it's not very good. So let me just place some pillars down 
and uh, I can place some floors on top of it. There you go guys, that is the manager's room done. Now we just need to add a nice little roof onto everything and uh, I'll show you guys it in a second. I just have a few little tweaks I want to do to the manager's room because it looks a bit like trashy right now. It's just a bare minimum so I do want to change that. So if I just place all of this stuff, for some reason it's not placing properly so I have to go back over that one spot. Look at that, let's just get rid of these and uh let me just take a look at the manager's room from the outside so oh, that's not where i want to go let's go here um it looks okay it could be a little bit better at this bottom bit so let's go ahead and change up all of that and we'll also go ahead and add in some lights too okay guys there you go that's a little bit more like i added a nice little greenhouse and some decorations um i added a nice little balcony little like not really a balcony but it's just like an edge bit oh nearly fell off <laughs> that is very good but um yeah it goes all the way around and uh we need to sprite uh, not sprite up spruce up the inside a little bit with some more shelves now let's see what else i can actually add because i'm not really sure what else i should add what goes with ice cream maybe we could have a fruit section because like you know strawberry ice cream you know and like homemade ice cream no maybe we could do some blenders and stuff as well maybe that'll be good Alright guys, I think that is it for the store, so let's go ahead and see what we've got now. So if we walk inside of one of the two doors, we have a nice open area and uh, lots of different nice lovely purple decorations to go match with the purple employee, purple walls, purple or everything. And if we go over here, we have ice cream and a nice little wooden wall. And uh, we have more ice cream and more ice cream here. Now if we go up the stairs here, we have uh, lots of fruits. Oh. I should probably fix that. Uh, we have lots of fruits here. We've got apples, pears, tomatoes, grapes, bananas, pineapples, and more apples and bananas. Because, you know, they're the most like, popular like ice cream flavours, you know. And if you go to the other side here, we have blenders to make our own ice cream and milk and some more ice cream as well. So we can, like, make hybrid flavours, if that makes sense. We have some more milk, more blenders, more ice cream. Let's go ahead and open up shop and let's take a step outside. Just take a look at what we've got. Like, literally, this is amazing, guys. Oh, my sign. I never moved my sign back. Okay, let's quickly do that. So, quickly move that up to the third floor. Out of bounds, what do you mean? Okay, I'm going to place it on the second floor or just the first floor. Boom, just like that. I think that's nice. That is amazing, guys. And it covers the ugliness of the manager's room as well, with all the crates and stuff. But let's go ahead and see what I've done inside the manager's room. Just a bunch of crates. And, um, yeah, it is really good. All right, I do have extra storage now. I have 6,500. And customers are flocking in. They love the store. I, I don't think I really spent that much money on the store. I started with, like, 300 or 1,000. Or 320,000. So, yeah, I spent, like, not that much money at all, guys. And I don't know what's happened to my animation. I'm more, I'm, like, static completely. But yeah, guys, I'll leave the shop running for a little bit. Let's just see how it goes. You know, finance rep is doing its job. Cashier, Abby is doing her job. And John... Uh, restocker, who's this? What's your name? What's your name? Hey, Nancy. Oh, people going up and down the stairs everywhere. I wonder if I'm five stars. No, I'm four stars. So it's because my decoration's bad. Oh, you know what? I need to add some decoration upstairs. Because I removed all of those things, didn't I? Okay, let's add that. Um, and here, let's add that as well. One either side. Here you go, guys. I think my decoration issue is now sorted, pretty much. Yeah, it's just a few. Yeah, there you go. Five stars, guys. I'll constantly go up and down because customers are really annoying sometimes. Just vote badly for no reason. But yeah guys, I think that was it for this video. If you enjoyed, please remember to smash that like down below and subscribe with the notification button turn on so you never miss another brand new video on the channel. I'd greatly, greatly appreciate that. And um, yeah, I really just really hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making this shop a lot. And if you want more, just let me know. Remember to join my Discord server as well. And yeah, peace out guys.